When the corruption case involving former Mkhatani High School principal Simon Makubu resumed at the High Court on Tuesday before High Court Judge Mbutomamba, Senior Crown Counsel Matebo Nguman called in another witness in Detective Inspector Simon Msibi, who is the leading investigator in this case. Msibi informed the court that on the 14th of December 2015, he got a docket which was registered in Peace Peak Police Station. The docket was from the Ministry of Education and Training from the Principal Secretary. Msibi informed the court that investigations proved that the principal Simon Makovo made some staff members to cash checks on behalf of one Shabu Temkinsi Lamini. He informed the court that on the 18th of December 2012, he led a team of investigators to Makovo's residence. And after introducing himself and the team, he showed Makovo a search warrant and searched the house. He then arrested Makovo after he had informed him of the judge's rule, but they got nothing from the house. He said he then proceeded to the school where he said they conducted a diligent search and seized documents, which included used and unused checks, invoices, receipts, and other documents. Msibi informed the court that he brought Makubu to Mbabane, where he was formally charged. Msibi said investigations uncovered that there was a check written to pick blocks. He then went to pick blocks and discovered that the service rendered was not rendered to the school, but to Makubu's premises. He said he also discovered checks that were payable to CP Auto Machine, which were written on the same date. The checks include a check of 145,999, 200,000, 38,000, 150,000 They were all dated on the 1st of February 2012. The first three checks had no supporting documents. MCB informed the court that on the 8th of April 2015, he then led a team of officers to CP Auto Machine in Checkers. He said upon arrival, they found the director, Mr. Thorpe, and accused number five. And after introducing themselves and the purpose of their visit, they conducted a diligent search and seized some documents. After analyzing the documents, they discovered that three invoices attached to some of the checks were not made from the current invoice book. In April 2013, Msibi informed the court that they went back to CP Auto Machine and arrested Comfort Lope with Vusan Lope, his co-director. Investigations also uncovered that Makubu continued to sign certain documents while he was under suspension, yet those documents are part of evidence before court. With the Minister for Commerce, Shablane Mabuza, who is the director of Bycash Hardware, was presenting his evidence before court, he informed the court that he was still expecting payment of 20,000 Malangini from Tlatane High School on behalf of M&Q Poultry Suppliers. While when the investigator, Simon Mnis, was presenting his evidence before court on Tuesday, he informed the court that Mlatane High School had paid M and Q what was due to them, but the money belonging to buy cash was not deducted. High Court Judge Shimbutomamba postponed the case to Wednesday morning. It will resume at half past nine. For Society TV News, I'm LinkedIn Gule with Ernest Mabaso at the High Court.